Hello everyone. So it's come to my attention that the um, reading app download link from the official website is currently not working. I tried to use it and nothing happens when you push the link. So we're going to use an APK today. Now the first APK that we're going to look at is the one Dojia, which is what we used to use a long time ago. And I've already checked the versions. Our reading app version currently on Android, which is on my phone, is 3240211. So when we click into the one dojia, we have 4240142. So this is a slightly older version. It should still be okay though. It's only a little bit older and it should have an update once you've downloaded. We've also got the WAP version. The WAP version is also 0142. Next up, we have PC6, which is showing a much older version, so we'll just stay away from that one. I like ones that have the version. So we're going to try the one doja for today, okay? So obviously, if this is unsuccessful, this video will not go up, and I will try the other one again. So one doja has a little bit of an issue, and that's they try to get you to download the Chinese app store. So you don't want to do that. So let me first copy this link so I can post it with this video. Next up, there's a little checkbox here and you're gonna want to uncheck that. That is a safe download. If you have it changed into English, it will tell you secure download. Um, It's not really a secure download in that it's it's downloading a Chinese app store. It's gonna cram up your phone. You really don't wanna do that. So please remember to uncheck this, okay? Now, I'm going to get rid of the translated box. I'm going to leave it on Chinese, but all the buttons are in the same spot, no matter if it's Chinese or English. Now, the bar turns gray when you uncheck the box, and you're going to hit that gray button. The download should come down at the bottom, and you can hit the OK. Then you're going to hit the Open, and we're going to install Palfish Read. That's basically it. The next step would be logging in. Okay. Play Protect hasn't seen this app before. To protect your send it for a security scan. Um, if you want to, you can try that. I'm not going to because I know the Palfish reading app is safe. It's, it's something I know. I've used it for two years now. I've never had an issue. So... Bum, 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 bum. Wait for installation to complete. Wait for installation to complete. Wait for installation to complete. It might take a moment. Sometimes it does. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, app installed. We're going to hit open now. Now comes the most annoying part of the whole process, and that's getting logged in. And this is for Apple or Android. So we want to hit on this one, the blue button. The blue button is now okay once you're in the app. That's just agreeing to the terms and conditions. Remember, we are teachers. We cannot do the verify code login. This is for students only. So down here under on in Android, it's or on Android, it's in Chinese. So you're going to need to press this button here and it's in the same location as iOS but in iOS I believe it's in English this is password login so we're going to click password login it brings us to this page this is the password login to page for the students look up here at the top and it says palfish teacher login we want to physically press these words please I cannot enunciate that enough this is where the most problems occur people don't understand that they need to press this This does not mean that this is the teacher login page. This is a tab. This is a separate tab button. It doesn't look like the button, but it is a button. Okay? So please press the Palfish Teacher Login button. Boink. You can see Palfish Teacher Login has disappeared. And now we are just going to log in. So you'll select and enter your information and log in. And that should get you going. Again, always, if you have any questions, message me. If there are problems, let me know, etc., etc. I like to know these things so I can update everyone, okay? Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.